You. Are you tired of your Discord friends ignoring you? Well, here at SellChildren.com, we don't care what your answer is. Buy our products. Please. Introducing our latest and greatest idea, the Discord Bot Army. Alright, so for demonstration purposes, I'll be showing you the bots in action. So all we have here is a Discord bot like these, except they all have different keys, and this script runs all of them at the same time. So let's run this one, let's join a voice channel, and let's type the command to let all of them join at the same time, which is a vertical bar followed by the word join. Then this happens. Hi, I'm Dennis, or you could call me Creepy D. In this video, we'll be raiding Discord servers with the bots that you were shown earlier. Now, before we continue with the video, I do need to let you know that a huge part of this video was inspired by Call Me Carson's video about raiding Discord servers. I also do need to mention that we did get permission from all the server owners whose servers we raided in this video. I'll be sure to link all of their servers in the description of this video. One last thing before we start, we didn't completely demolish their servers. All we did was get 10 bots to join their voice channels and play some sounds. With that said, I really, really hope that you enjoy this video. Alright, so let me explain how this works. Here, we have all the Discord bots, which there are 10 of. All of them cover about 15 inches when combined. You know, this 15 inch bar reminds me of my PP size. 15 millimeters, or at least when fully erect. Each of these bots have the exact same code except for their token. All the code does is make the bot join a voice channel when this command gets typed into a text channel. After the bot joins, it then starts playing one of these audio files. Alright, so in order to test the bots, we will be needing to go through some phases. So the first phase is to feed the children in my basement. That's not, that's my to-do list. I'm so sorry about that. I am, I don't know what that is, sorry. Um, here's the actual one. <clears throat> Bury the body. <laughs> okay, okay, no. I don't know why that's there, just no. Uh, I think this, I think this should be the right one. <clears throat> Sell some of them on the dark web. Okay, <laughs> I, I don't know where... I don't know where these came from. They're they're not mine. Please just they're, they're not mine, guys. I I don't know where they came from. I. <sighs> okay, so there will be five phases. The first one being that we need to find some servers that we can get the bots to join. The second phase will be to ask a server owner's permission to get the bots to join. The third phase will be to get the bots to join the actual servers. In phase four, we will be activating the bots, as well as getting the bots to join a voice channel with other people in it. Then, for the final phase, which is phase five, we will be recruiting members for my army. See, there's something I haven't told you yet. Remember when World War III almost happened? Well, I was so excited. I, I just couldn't wait to see fairies fighting to the death. Oh, oh, wait, wait, sorry, sorry. That's my fanfiction about falling in love with a furry. It's a fanfiction about myself falling in love with a furry who got me pregnant and went to World War III to fight other furries. The thing is, though, the twist comes in when you find out that I'm not the mother. And that might sound like it doesn't make any sense, but don't worry, I'm still figuring that out. If this video gets 100 likes, I'll be releasing the fanfiction. Okay, so now it is time to find some servers, and I did. I found these two servers that we'll be rating in this video. I'll leave a join link to both of them in the description of this video. The next step was to get permission from the server owners. One of them I know IRL, so I just asked over a call and got permission. The second one is a longtime friend, but we don't really know each other in real life. But I still got permission, so everything worked out. The next step was to get the bots to join. Pretty easy enough. The next step was to get people to join voice channels, and then get the bots to join and play army sounds. This is what I got. Alright, so I just made all of these bots join one of my friend's servers. Let's just give them all the same name. Yeah, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get all the bots online. I'm gonna join them. I'm not gonna say anything. And then I'm just gonna activate the bots, make them join, see what happens. Ryan. Ryan. Ryan is the soldier of NATO. Yeah. Ah. Dennis, uh, yeah. I can't get this Dennis, I can't Okay, I, I guess, I guess that's enough people for the announcement. <clears throat>
<laughs> oh no, you're joking, you're joking. Wait a second, wait a second, no. Wait, 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 just, just pause real quick. That's actually right, that's what happened. When we got the bots to join, I only gave them permission to join voice channels and use their voice. So the bots actually couldn't read the join command. But anyway, after some time, we, we fixed everything, so it all worked out. I, I, I had a question, but you know, I'm just... I'm just I'm just gonna show you guys <clears throat> what I wanted to do this whole time. Make sure you have a uh, sound turned on, by the way. Turn it to the max. <clears throat> With that said, who wants to join the army? <laughs> he said, "I hear Hitler." <laughs> All right, so that's the end of the video. No, nobody really had the reaction that I was hoping they would have. And and yeah, I, I hope that you enjoyed this video. And other than that, I hope to see you in the next video. Yes.